Hey guys, Tommy Boy 601 and today we're going to be taking a look at a glitch that has just revealed itself in Rainbow Six Siege. Now, in order to do this glitch, you are going to need Capkin because the glitch affects his laser trip mine. Now, what the glitch does is it actually removes the red laser from the laser trip mine when it's planted, thus making it much harder for any of the attacking operators to see and detect. To do this glitch, it's relatively easy and something that can be done very easily during a preparation phase. In order to do this glitch, all you need to do is one, plant the trip mine like you would usually do, then go up to it and press the remove trip mine button. As soon as the character touches it, press the plant trip mine button immediately, and this will cause him to cancel out the action of removing it, but it will keep the trip mine planted without the laser to give away its position. Now the metal shaft that usually marks Capkin's trap locations will still be there, but when you do this glitch, I would suggest you change up how you would usually play Capkin. Usually when you play Capkin, you wanna put the trip mines on doors that are very popularly just like gone through or places that have high, high traffic that you then board up and defend. With this glitch, I would suggest you spread out the laser trip mines among the map. That way, you're much more likely to get attackers, one, when they're heading towards the site that you're trying to defend, or B, in the later moments of the game, when people are using not so common frank flanking routes, they may get picked up by one of these traps. Now, this combination is very powerful. I, f I know that usually when I use Capkin, it's rare for me ever to get a laser trip mine kill. And in me, in just a couple of rounds of me using it, I was getting a kill almost every single match with this glitch. So it is very powerful. Now, heads up and a warning. When I did use this glitch, it did start to make the laser trip mines bug out when I just placed them regularly. It would cause the laser to go off in a weird angle that it wasn't supposed to. And at one point, it even glitched me through a wall. So be aware of that. Um, it could end up breaking your game for a match um and that may not be that enjoyable but yeah that is the glitch now i do need to give a special shout out to the youtuber make peace not war he was able to help me test this so that i was able to get all this footage go ahead and check out his channel but also go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down below and give this video a like if you find this content unique and cool so yeah guys hope you like this video i'm tommyboy601 see ya